Yo guys, 2017, new year, new setup. Let's talk wallpapers. So my favorite wallpaper app has been an app called Frame. Frame provides high quality wallpapers. They all look really good, they're all free, and the app itself is very easy to navigate. Now, I did say the app is free, but there are obtrusive pop-up ads that occur every time you download a wallpaper. Yeah, they are really annoying, but you know, I think it's worth the trade-off for all these high quality good looking photos that would be pretty hard to find with a simple Google search. That widget that you see on the top of my home screen is from Zuper Widget. Now I know Zuper Widget is old and outdated at this point, but there's still a lot of developer support. And this is from the skin called Zuper Collection. Now pretty much all the Zuper skins do the same thing. They show you the counter dates, uh, weather, and time, and all the other good stuff. They just all have their own typography to them and their own style. I like the style of this one, it was matching the look I was going for, but again, there are tons of free ones in a Play Store they can choose from and some paid ones as well. But what I'm most excited for is this counter widget. This counter widget is freaking awesome. It's called Month. Now you can customize how many weeks you want to see on your screen. Right now I have two weeks displayed. And you can also customize the look of it. Of course I have a transparent look displayed right now to match my whole transparent theme I have going on. Now what's really cool is that if you hit any day on the calendar, it will pop up in its own folding window and show you the events for that day. And then you can swipe left to right to see the next day's event or previous day's events. So moving on, you might have noticed that I do not have a dock at the bottom of my home screen and I just have a swipe up gesture instead. Well that's not an app, it's actually a feature of Nova Launcher. So Nova Launcher is the launcher I'm using, and it's honestly the best launcher that you can find on Android. It has so many features, so many customizations I use it for, and the launcher is constantly up to date, which I really love. When Android Nougat was released, the developer added some Nougat-like stylizations, some features. So this launcher is honestly the best you can get on Android, hands down. The icon pack that I'm using is called Irid UI is Hipster. Now this is all subjective, but I really love this icon pack. I love the vintage style it applies to all the icons, and it really matches the wallpaper that I normally choose, and kind of gives my phone the whole vintage feel when I'm going for that style. Now to the left of my main home screen, I have two more widgets, a Twitter widget and a news widget. My Twitter widget is using the app called Taloon, and my news widget I'm using is from Feedly, a very popular RSS reader, I highly recommend it. And finally, I have to mention the app Weather Timeline. Guys, this app looks great. I talked about this before, I just want to talk about it again. The UI of this app is amazing, and it tells you everything you ever want to know about the weather, and the widget is very customizable and very information dense, which I love. So guys, this has been a quick look at my Android setup. Leave comments down below about which app you like, and if you have any app suggestions. If you liked this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to go and follow me on social media. And as always, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for another galvanizing video. Thanks.